What's up guys? Well, I did a couple minor upgrades to my PC and one major one. Well, we'll start with the minor ones first. First uh, minor one is my Logitech mouse's laser decided to die, so I had to uh, get a new mouse. So I went with a, uh, a Zowie EC2A. It's very lightweight, very ergonomic. It has a great laser. And just a quick touch on lasers and mice. I see a lot of people just going in like uh, comment sections and going on and on about, well, it doesn't have the best laser in the world, so it's a terrible mouse, blah, 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 blah. Well, the laser is only about half of the equation here. If you aren't comfortable using your mouse, if it's not comfortable, if it doesn't fit in your hand right, you are not going to be able to aim good in like first person shooters and stuff. It's just not going to happen. No matter how good the laser is, no matter how cool it looks, you know, it's just not going to work. Now, I'm not saying this is the best mouse in the world, don't get me wrong. It's definitely got its faults. It has no software whatsoever. Uh, the DPI toggles underneath here, right there. That's a little annoying, although I don't really change my DPI on the fly. I just got it, set it, I think, 800. Yeah, I have it 800 right now. That's about what I use. Anyway, that's about it for the mouse. Great mouse. Love it. Improved my aim a uh, huge amount. Second thing is, I got a new 140 millimeter fan for the back there. Got tired of looking at the, uh, the 120. It just looked way too small in that space. But, if you can probably already notice from this shot, the number one upgrade is definitely this Predator EK240. Uh, it's very, very nice. Uh, it's pretty much an all-in-one, but it's made out of custom loop parts. That's all pre-filled for you, and it's great. Uh, I have it uh, set up as intake right now, so it gets air from the side here, the side little vent. But now I know a lot of people are going to say, well, why do you have your CPU heating up your whole system? Well, there's two reasons for that. One, it wouldn't fit on my top of my case. My mother would have hit my motherboard. It's too thick of a radiator. And two, it doesn't really make that much of a difference when you're just cooling your CPU. Now, if you had a couple GPUs or a GPU in the loop and then you put that radiator in your front, it would probably make your case temperatures go up quite a bit. I honestly haven't noticed like my GPU get any hotter than it normally does. It might have gone up a degree or two. Not a big deal for me. But that's about it for this video, honestly. I just want to do a quick little update here. And uh, I would definitely highly recommend anybody looking to get into water cooling to just skip all those all-in-ones, those ones from Corsair and stuff. I mean, they're all right. I mean, but they are to perform better than this. They have to have the loudest fans in the entire world. My H100i with its stock fans literally sounded like my PC wanted to take off and start hovering on my desk. Let's put it that way. This thing, full load, I can't even hear it. As loud as it is right now, it is as loud as it is under gaming conditions. It just doesn't get any louder than this. I really like this quiet computer. Literally the only noise in the room right now besides me talking is I have a window fan exhausting air because my room gets extraordinarily hot. Speaking of which, it's 77 Fahrenheit in here right now. It's actually cooler than usual. It's usually about 80 in here. <laughs> but anyway, that's about it for this quick little update video. I definitely uh, enjoyed putting that in. I gotta say, that EK before I go is also the easiest water cooling setup I have ever installed bar none. It's even easier than some air coolers other than a couple extra steps to screw the radiator in, but that's literally putting a couple screws into a, a radiator. I'm pretty sure about anybody can handle that. But anyway, that's about it for this video. Hope you enjoyed it. Till the next one. Peace out, guys.